What's up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero. Welcome to episode 23 of our Pokemon Let's Go playthrough. In the last episode, we're here in the game corner where we wound up having the coolest scene event, wherever you want to call it, that we've had so far in this game. In today, oh, and then we took on, uh, in part two, we took on Archer and Giovanni here uh, in Giovanni's little office, Giovanni's room. On uh, today's episode, we're making our way back to Lavender Town to follow Cubone, who left from here. So if you're excited for more Let's Go, hit the thumbs up, make sure you subscribe, and thank you, as always, for checking out our series. Let's get to it. Cubone seems to have gone home to its own town. Why don't you get out of here, too, and try to figure out how to use that self scope or something? So we're just going to wallow in pity here, or what? You're just going to, like, sit in there and just be sad for yourself? Because, like, I totally understand that. <laughs> We've all been there, bro. We've all failed miserably. We've all failed miserably. Let's get it. Run out of game coins. So, do I ever get to a point where I can collect prizes or something? We about to learn something new. Oh, you're curious, aren't you? You're curious about me and this machine. Do you want to know the details? I sure do. Okay, if you insist, this machine is a great vehicle that allows you to fly in the sky. It's a marvelous invention, if I do say so myself. It's not an exaggeration to say that this is a secret technique. Even though I worked really hard on this, nobody wants to try it. You seem to be a courageous young boy. I'll tell you how to ride this machine, the secret technique Sky Dash. Oh, that Eevee wants to fly my invention instead of you? Great, it matches my inspiration perfectly. All right, let's get right to it. Do this and that, hold this handle, and pull. Then, that will be that will be like that. And with these balloons, you're in the air. Pikachu learns Sky Dash. Select play with Jet in the main menu and see yeah, yeah, yeah. You have this machine, so be sure to, to make enjoy many trips through the sky. Now, I would do that, but there's one stop I want to make on the way back to Lavender Town. Before we go to Lavender Town, there's one stop I want to make. You like how I just said the same thing twice? Why did I do that? But anyway. <clears throat> Is Jet guy? I think Jet might wind up making it the entire playthrough on our team. He just might make it. But yeah, there's one stop I want to make. Whoa, look at the wild nine tails. Alright, we're going to cut through. Oh dear, I think I gave that poor guard too many pewter crunchies to eat. They're rather dry if you don't have any tea or anything to wash them down. Oh, that tea you have, it looks awfully tasty. What, I can have a drink? Gee, thanks. If you really want to go to Saffron City, I guess I can let you pass. Or I'll share this tea with the guys working the... Whatever, you know what he said. He said the same thing for 22 years. <laughs> I'm not looking, I'm not looking, I can't see anything. I'm just using this as a pass through. I went too far. I really can't see. That's why I went too far. I don't want to see anything. It's spoilers. It's literally spoilers for me. Okay. It's literally spoilers. I don't I don't want spoilers. Ooh. If the Pokemon you're walking with suddenly stops if it's surprised. Oh, thanks. Thanks for telling me. Pokemon I'm walking with. Who should I walk with? I'm going to walk with Jet. Or with Joy, excuse me. I'm going to walk with Joy. Shinies? Mm -hmm. Shinies? No, I'm kidding. I, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I, I, don't, I don't expect another Shiny to pop up. We've gotten one live Shiny to pop up. I have been meaning to come back to her for a long time. Oh my, you've got five scra scra Scratch Cat Pokemon. As promised, take this pretty Pokemon. She just gifted us an Arcanine? Oh! A 
legendary Pokemon in the East means people are charmed by the grace and beauty of its running. When the adorable puppy Pokemon Growlithe evolves, it'll look like this. Oh, it's adorable as ever. Arcanine is the best. Huh? Why did I make you catch Scratch Cat Pokemon and then give you a puppy Pokemon? Because I want to see if your preference would stay the same. Even after seeing so many Meow. Teehee. Take Arcanine on its Pokeball. Okay. I've got to try this. I've got to try this. I was just talking about... No, I wasn't. Uh, I was thinking... Where is he? There he is. Add the party. I'm going to put Brit. Just a minute, because I really want to see this. Because this is like the bicycle. Now, Onyx, don't be upset with me. This looks incredible. What more do I... What, what, what am I supposed to say? Look at this. Look at how smooth it is. Hold on. If I, You know what would have been really cool? If I keep running and he just jumped over it. Oh, I'd have been sold. You'd have never seen me play another video game in my life. <laughs> You'd have never seen another game in my life. This would have been... If he'd have jumped over that... Okay, hold on. No! Oh, shoot. I thought I went into a cutscene. I was going to be super upset, man. Okay. I just don't want to see anything. It's just kind of spoilers to me. It's just kind of spoilers to me. Because I'm not in Saffron just yet. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. This is awesome! Oh! So, that's Cubone's mom. That's right. Team Rocket keeps on going after Marowak so it can sell those skulls they wear for profit. I think Cubone is still looking for its mother, even though she's gone. I just can't forgive that Team Rocket. Me neither. I saw Cubone heading into the tower a little while ago, too. I'll go look for it, and I'll keep an eye out for that, for that Mr. Fuji, too. The one who's been missing. Thank you, and be careful. I, I really don't like ghosts, but I've got to do this. What he should do is just, like, look up. Just look up. And see me here. I'm not that far away. Alright, and now all we can do as we said. Since we're going into the, this place, we're going to take... take you on. Alright. Ah, Domino, nice timing. You caught most of that, right? What do you say? You want to come with me? No. Right, then I'll just wait. Aww. See, he's just creepy. He's just... I don't know. Thanks, pal. It'll be a big relief to have you. I'll just let you lead the way, okay? What? Please don't be, like, following me, following me. Okay, good. Alright, I'm ready. I'm, I'm freaking ready. Oh, I forgot. I gotta get Go back up. Alright, um, now that we're here... Who's leading our party? Should be Golbat. Okay, perfect. Our Golbat is the... He's the one. He's the one. Ugh. Urgh. Do, do you really think there are ghosts in here? Huh, Domino, what's that? The Silphscope revealed the ghost's true form. Okay. Whoa, whoa, that's crazy. So those ghosts were actually Pokemon? Oh, and then they just went away? Oh, well, hello. Be gone, malevolent spirit. Ah, 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 ah. Chandler Patricia. Don't know how I feel about you having that name. Don't know how I feel. All right, we're crunching everybody. We're crunching everybody. Okay, I understand why these levels are lower. I understand why these levels are, are lower. I'm just gonna have to accept that the levels are gonna be a little lower while we're going through here. You're sending out a what? 
You said Chansey? Oh. I was so confused. I thought it said Chansey. I was like, why do you have a Chansey? You should not have a Chansey. That's not... Wait, I don't need to crunch Ghastlies. I should save my... Cr I can probably wing attack and Oko these things. Ooh, this will be a nice restock on Pokeballs going through the, going through here. <laughs> Wah! These, you know what? Chandler, Chandler, Carly. All right, I'm gonna try out my, my theory here. I think Wing Attack should OK these things based on what I saw against Rattata. I can't imagine. Ghastly's defense, okay. I can't imagine Ghastly's defense is too much better than Rattata's. Yeah. Literally gas. I also don't know why flying type, flying moves, I don't know why, I don't know why any physical attack ever hits Gengar. That's a different story. Now wait a minute. Where are the Pokemon at? Alright, Chansey, you're having a really hard time with this. I'm about to sneeze! Well, I'm not about to sneeze. Whatever. I guess it just happens. As you can tell, got my mute set up! We should move through this pretty quick because we, we can just... We're just going to get sucker punched 500 times in this place. You know what? I'm just going to accept it. I'm just going to accept it. Pokemon characteristics. Talked about it before. I guess ghost types. Most ghost types I don't think should be hit by physical moves. The first wild Pokemon of the day. I just have a feeling it's going to be really annoying, but whatever. Hold on, let me let him go past, and then he's going to come back, and then I'm going to toss. Where did that ball go? <laughs> Where did that ball go? <laughs> how far can I throw a ball? Wait, I'm almost curious how far can I throw a ball. Also, I... I on Pokemon that are on the ground, all right, I'm not gonna waste my time with this thing. But on Pokemon that are on the ground, I've perfected my throw, perfected. I have figured out how to actually throw the ball. Chansey's really struggling in here. Like, really struggling in here. Found an escape rope, escape rope. The hidden items here? Binoculars. She has binoculars. She she was staying over there like this. Oh, I found you. <laughs> All right. I was too far ahead. I'm hoping that Erica's ace is like level 34. That would be nice. That would be nice and challenging if it was level 34. That would be, I'd be A okay with that. Let's go. Oh, look at this. Look at these little shortcuts that we got. People. Chandler Jody. That just reminded me. I was gonna. 
I don't know why. Seeing seeing that name just made me re remember to text somebody. <laughs> Level 33, yeah, yeah. These are all the same battles. It's all the same. Oh, you have a hunter. <gasps> Finally, something worth, worth my time. Oh, that's a nice animation, hunter. Unfortunately, that's about all you're going to get to do. Okay, you're going to sucker punch me. And then you're going to die. Yeah, you had no chance. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, Hunter. Teleport. A good place for teleport, but why is teleport a TM? It is 2018. Found a Fulio. Not complaining about that one. Whoop, gone. You slow! Wait, what did she just say? She said something about a bone? I have no idea what she said. She may have said something about a cue bone. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. How many floors are in this? I think there's... I don't know how many more floors there are. I mean, I could catch that Q-Bone. It's really not that big of a deal. So I think there's this floor, and then there's one more floor, and then we're at the top. I think. I think there's two more floors, and then we're at the top. But this is the floor that we get to heal. This is literally just training grounds for Golbat. Like, he's gonna get sucker punched. Oh, no sucker punch this time. But literally, he's okoing everybody. He's just destroying everybody. Brock is. <laughs> Brock's just sitting in the back, still over leveled. Still over leveled, but that's okay. He won't be used in this gym. He'll probably be used in the next gym, even though his attack stat is embarrassingly low. Come, come, child. I have a purified sp I have purified this space here. You can rest yourself a moment. Okay, I didn't need it twice. She said zombies? Oh! Ghastly! We gotta go catch Ghastly. I don't have a Ghastly yet. I've got to go catch Ghastly. I feel like I've just been sitting here dancing to the same song for approximately 18 and a half minutes. Actually, I've probably been sitting here doing it for approximately 15 minutes. But who's better? Who would be better to fight these people? I don't know. So if you're... Let's, since, since we're just doing the same stuff over and over again. If you're checking out this series, think about it. You can comment if you want to. What's been your favorite part of the game so far? Ooh, give me, okay, well, give me both of them. What's been your favorite part of the game so far? You got a tiny one. Um, let's see. I'm thinking really ghastly. Really ghastly. That's how you. That's how you're gonna do. That's how you're gonna do. Stay. Pokemon never stay. You know this. this, this. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Ooh, you almost had me. All right, I'm going. Oh, 
I'm surprised he stayed. I am genuinely surprised he stayed. Pokemon usually don't stay in the ball for me. Usually they don't. Said to appear in decrepit, deserted buildings. It has no real shape. It appears to be made of gas. Seems legit. And this one is huge. And he's got an attitude. I can already tell. Drop it. Drop it. Wow, really? What? That's not the direction I threw at all. In any way, shape, or form. Throw that way. Okay, I maybe understand why. I maybe understand why that happened. Whoa! He caught on the first ball. On the first one that he went into. Right? I'm surprised he did. I'm very surprised he actually stayed in the ball. I found an ice stone! No! What's better on our team? A fire type or an ice fairy type? I still don't know which nine tails I want to use. I really don't. I feel like it would make sense to do either one because obviously Brock took care of Vulpix. Susie's Vulpix in the anime. But Brock is also a breeder, so Brock would definitely have a an Alolan nine or an, an Alolan Vulpix. If he was in like if he was an actual member of the the anime team. Now. Oh, I got started talking on what's your what what your favorite part of the game was. Um, I think possible. Viridian Forest is pretty cool. Mount Moon was pretty cool. Nugget Bridge was... I like Nugget Bridge. Um, the SSN was probably, is probably up there as one of the best areas. And I think Rock Tunnel had a lot of trainers. Goodness gracious. But I think it did a good job with with the execution of what is Rock Tunnel. But then the game corner that we just did in the last episode. Spot on. Spot on. Spot on. Okay. I'm going to heal. Wait, I'm not going to heal yet. Take you on, and then I'm going to heal. I think they really did just keep all of the trainers in. All of the trainers that they had before, I think they kept them all in. This lady has three Pokemon. This this begs to ask the old question. Would you rather see six trainers with one Pokemon? Or one trainer with six Pokemon? When you're playing through a game. For me, it really doesn't matter. Personally, I think it'd be cool if all the trainers had six Pokemon. But... When you think about playing through in a timely manner, the way it is now war is makes the most sense. I've been hit by more sucker punches in this episode than I think I've ever been hit with sucker punches in my life. And I'm pro it's probably not over. There's probably more to come. There's probably more to come. All right, now that we've taken out this floor. But no, I mean, wouldn't it make sense if like, well, I guess you could use the argument of like, like say the three that are in picture right now, their whole thing is they, they just live here. So they just do this. So maybe them having two or three Pokemon in each makes sense. She said destruction, despair. People are crazy. But like, but then how fun is it to fight the same thing 
this is now the third floor or the it's either the third or fourth floor that I'm facing trainers that have level 25 Ghastly Hunter Ghastly watch I bet that's the team that I wind up facing Hunter Hunter's next I think see here comes Hunter and then she's gonna send out another Ghastly and I'm not critiquing the game I, I love the game I love this game. I just think it's funny that I can predict. And it, it, I think it's funny that all the trainers have the same thing. They're the same thing. But when you have 151 Pokemon to choose from, and only three ghosts, right? I'm pretty sure these were the only three ghosts in the game. Oh, it feels weird. Scratching my arm and I can feel it in my pinky. That's strange. I guess that's... I don't know. Can you tell that there's nothing going on right now? Huh? <laughs> oh my goodness, there's so many trainers. There's at least... I mean, confirmed, there's at least two more. I, would, I wouldn't be surprised there's more than that. The only reason this is weird is because in Gen 7, there were nowhere near this many trainers. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why do you ran? Oh, you're level 32 all of a sudden. I didn't even notice that. I didn't even notice you were... Can I switch to somebody else? Who else, who else can take this? Susie, come on out here. I want to change in scenery. I just want to change in scenery. Is this the is this the three haunter lady? I feel like I remember somebody using three haunters before. Ooh, nice. I mean, I'm gonna have to use another one, but do a lot of damage. I did a lot. Oh, and. Of course, <laughs> See, I always get the crit when it doesn't matter. Another Haunter. See, actually, I could have saved that crit for this turn. Because I'm going to need it. Thank you for avoiding that attack. Oh my goodness. The way this game has been so far... I that I expected that to hit. I expected that to hit. Okay, so I like that battle. I like that one. On to the next. Crazy. One Pokemon? Oh. I was thinking maybe it was a Gengar. Maybe it was a Gengar. Back to level 25s. Who was the one lady that had three level 23s? Or level 32s? Who was she? Is she just a random person? I don't get it. I don't understand it. Three Ultra Balls. A Hyper Potion. Uh-oh. It's going down. Be gone. Be gone, intruders. This one's even bigger than the last one. Domino, use the thing. The thing you used last time. Well, we got a movie? Wait, we got a movie here? <gasps> oh my gosh, it's a Marowak. 
It's Mommy Whack! It's Mommy Whack! I hate to tell you this, kid. He's gone. The true form of the ghost was the restless spirit of Cubone's mother. The mother spirit was calm, returning to its kind and gentle nature. It departed to the afterlife and disappeared. Cubone, or Cubone, you, you just came here because you wanted to see your mom again, huh? Sorry for thinking your mom was scary, Cubone. Domino, I, I don't want to leave Cubone alone like this. I'm gonna go take it home. Oh, if there's someone named Fuji upstairs, do you think you could see him home too? Uh, I don't really care if he's okay by himself. Are you not scared at all, Domino? Man, you're full of confidence, pal. You definitely seem dependable. What? You rescued Cubone from Team Rocket? When did you go and get that strong? Right, well then. Guess I'll leave this up to you, Domino. Come on, Cubone. Okay, I was thinking maybe there'd be a trainer. Um, we're gonna heal, and then we're gonna continue. Because that's how we do things. And if I decide that we need to split it, then we'll split it! We got, we got all kinds of people popping up now. Oh, 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 jukes. I like being able to juke these wild Pokemon. It's a nice touch. You can literally just boop, 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 boop. Hey, you can't catch me. All right, let's see what's upstairs. I'm going to save. Because I don't know what's about to happen. Ooh, I'm at 49 Pokemon. Wait, that's it? Oh, okay. Stop right there. We'll be going first. With that spe specter out of the way, we can finally get to the top. You're the old geezer they call Mr. Fuji, right? You're gonna be repeating your Pokemon research for the glory of Team Rocket. Ignore us all you like. We're used to it. We won't take no for an answer. You'll help the boss whether you want to or not. Alright, who do I want to lead? Um, I guess I could just do like this. Uh, let's go... Susie and Brit. No, Susie and my Otis one. That'll work. Gramps here thinks he can resist, so we're setting him straight. You better disappear, Twerp, or be prepared, be prepared to fight. My voices are terrible. Especially for Team Rocket. Alright. Let's see here. I like this. I like this look. I'm gonna poison resist bug, right? That would just make sense, right? I don't know all my resistances. Hold on, hold on. Pokemon type chart. Images. All I need to know is if bug is resisted. Yes, it is. Okay. Wait, since I have it up, does it also does dark? Okay. So we're going to crunch the Arbok because he's going to use Glare, and I know he's going to use Glare, and it's going to make me mad. So we're just going to blow him up. <sighs> uh, uh, uh. Dang! Not the Nine Tails! Dang, they just teamed up. They did the same thing to me. They just teamed up on me. Alright, well, I'm gonna do this. So, if this kills... Awesome. Nine Tails can hit the, the Weezing, and we go on with our lives. Oh, come on. Come on! Team Rocket's level 34. 
That actually makes me hope that Erica's Pokemon are like level 36, 37. That would be nice. No! Ooh. Alright, I'm gonna go Bag. I'm gonna go Lemonade on here. And I'm probably gonna get paralyzed. That's my prediction. I think what's gonna happen is I'm gonna heal myself. He's gonna use Sludge Bomb on Ninetales, and I'm gonna be paralyzed. Watch, watch, keep watching, keep watching. Here it comes. Two of three. Oh, reverse psychology works every time. And you broke out of the paralysis. <sighs> Don't need you to break out of paralysis like that. You just stay paralyzed. <laughs> if you're paralyzed, stay paralyzed, dang it. I don't need this help. I don't need the extra help. What do you want? You'll regret this. Oh, you'll regret this. Ah, seriously, again? It looks like Operation Stealthily Kidnapped Fuji is a bust then. Don't you think I know that? It'll be fine, we just have to help out with the takeover of Silthco and Saffron City. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again! Yeah. Evie, why do you look completely exasperated? Evie, you didn't do anything. Wait, wait for it. Okay, you're good. We out of there. Oh, and who might you be? You came to save me from Team Rocket, thanks. But I didn't even notice they were here. I was too busy trying to calm the spirit of Marowak. I think Marowak's spirit has finally left us. I must thank you for your kind concern. Follow me to my home. It's the Pokemon house at the foot of this tower. So, Domino, your Pokedex quest is one that requires strong dedication. With a deep love for Pokemon, it will be hard to complete such a task. I'm not sure if this will help you, but I'd like you to have it. Oh. Upon hearing the Pokeflute, sleeping Pokemon will spring awake. Try using it if you ever find a sleeping Pokemon. That simple? You used to have some elaborate store. Hold on. Hold on. Go back inside. Go back inside. That can't be it. There's got to be some other text that's changed a little bit. It's so warm. Pokemon are so cuddly and nice to hug. Mr. Fuji went to try and bring some peace to the ghost of that Marowak. All right, hold on. If this winds up being a two-part episode, I want to do one more thing. There's no other text or anything? You rescued that Cubone from Team Rocket? Wow, that's pretty amazing. Take these as a thank you. That's why you talk to everyone multiple times. Thank you. I bet someone brave like you could go up to Pokemon Tower, no problem. I just did. Is that a cue for me to go back again? I'm gonna regret this. I shouldn't be doing this. There's no reason for me to go back to the top. No, there's no reason. You ain't tricking me. All right, one more thing I wanna do. Because next episode we're gonna set off, wait, that's the wrong thing. Next episode we're gonna set off towards Fuchsia City. Secret Techniques, Sky Dash. Take me right here. Yes. Let's see what this looks like. Oh, look at us. <laughs> you see the determined look in our face? Look at it. Look at it. Oh, never mind. Oh, he always has that face. I should heal. And then we're going to go capture a sleeping Pokemon. Now, I'm going to talk about this next episode as well, but I have a question. When you go towards Fuchsia City... Do you go down the Celadon side, or do you go down the Lavender side? 
let me know. I'm sure you can already guess which one I do based on where we're at. Oh, you know what? <laughs> I went to Vermilion sooner than I expected to. I was going to go Vermilion once we got over there after collecting the Poke Flute, but I collected the tea. Let me make you some tea. All right. Let's see what's this. Oh. Yes, use the Poke Flute. I should have saved. Dang, he popped straight up. Hey, Domino! Oh! There is something I forgot to mention when I gave you the Poke Flute. Oh, perfect timing! You see, this Pokemon is called Snorlax. It's been known to attack the first thing it sees after waking up. It thinks that it sees food. Since it can be pretty dangerous, please help it calm down by battling it with your Pokemon. Once you defeat it, it'll become more docile. You should be able to catch it, just like any other Pokemon. Snorlax mistook you for food and attacked. Did it just get a totem boost? It's level 34. It just got a totem boost. What do you mean I have five minutes to do this? What do you mean I have five minutes to do this? Headbutt. Ouch. That did just under half. I'm gonna click brick break. Ah. Don't you dare paralyze me. Don't you dare paralyze me. I'll go for the lemonade. No. No. Quick math. Quick math. So this is the first boss Pokemon. Ow. This Snorlax is not nice, is it? Oh, I just have to defeat it. I just have to defeat it. Hold on. If all I need to do is defeat it, then I'm okay. Not that... I know I make it sound like Onyx is just going to come in and smack this thing. Don't get me wrong. That's not going to happen. But I can try. That did less than Brick Break did. But that's what I was hoping for. I was really hoping for the flinch. I don't want everyone to fall asleep. All right, Jet, let's go. It's you and me, Jet. All right, Onyx, come on back. I was afraid of this. Right, I'm gonna have to start doing some real damage. Now, let's hit this double edge. Actually, you know what? I want to see how much my, this bubble thing, this might be broken. If this, depending on how much this does. Okay, it did about as much as double edge. So that tells me, is that a 100 base move? No way. No! We're gonna attack him again. I'm gonna fall asleep. Okay, if I can get one more off. If I can get one more off. Do not use rest this turn. Don't use rest this turn. Please don't use rest this turn. I have a minute and a half. If it uses rest this turn, I might not be able to get it done. Oh no! Oh my gosh, okay. 
What happens if I can't beat it in this time? I'm concerned. Hit it with another one. Then I'm going to use my bubble move. Actually, I'm going to go for it. We're going to go for it. We're going to go for it. Time's running low. Time's running low. Yes. Okay. I think I win. I think I win. I think I win. Woo! Oh my gosh. Now's your chance. Catch the wild snow axe. All right, we're gonna go bag, we're gonna go Raz. And we're gonna go Ultra Ball. Nice and excellent throw. Two, three, that's a... That's not a catch, hold on. Big boy. Uh, another excellent throw. Is this the one? Is this the one? Two? And the three? And the catch? Boom. I like that. I like that. Oh! Everyone... Nearly everyone grew level. I need to use Brit more. I don't know. This might be where Brit starts to fall behind. Egg Mom? Maybe? Let's see. What is that? Egg bomb. 100, accuracy 75. I currently have takedown, accuracy 85. Sure. I'm just gonna regret this. I'm gonna I'm gonna regret teaching that thing egg bomb. Brock grows to 37. Caught ourselves a Snorlax. We'll eat anything, even if the food happens to be a little moldy. Ew. Oh, that's gross. This Snorlax is 7 foot 11, but it doesn't weigh very much. Huh. Okay. Sure. Mr. Fuji still behind us? Oh my, Domino, that was impressive. There are other Pokemon out there that will try to attack trainers, just as Snorlax did. When facing such an, a Pokemon, the best thing to do is defeat it, then catch it. Remember, defeat, then catch, in that order. Alright, well... I think on that note, we're going to wrap up our Pokemon Tower adventures. In the next episode, we're going to head down uh, Pokemon Road, as it's called. I have a feeling I know what we're going to be doing in the next episode. I have a feeling. I don't know. I have a feeling. But if you enjoyed our Pokemon Tower Adventures, which will probably wind up being a part one, part two, which I think I just had the idea for how I want to upload those. But hit the thumbs up down below. Make sure you're subscribed. And I don't think I've said it in a couple episodes. But if you're checking out our series, of all the series that are out there, and you're this far in, episode 23, thank you. I appreciate it a lot. I really, 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 really do. Um, but again, next episode, we head down the Pokemon Road. I'm going to save right here. Right on Route 16. So again, thank you for checking out today's episode. We will see you in the next one. Until then, have a blessed day.